So preparing uh, the jugular vein is done in a similar manner for the angel that was done for the other products that we've uh, discussed. We like to get the jugular as clean as possible. Then what I like to do after the scrubbing of the jugular vein is to uh, utilize sterile gloves. With the angel system, we can draw as much as 540 cc's of blood because each cycle we can use uh, up to 180 and we can do that three times. So what we need to do is a ratio of seven to one for the ACDA to whole blood. Seven parts whole blood, one part uh, ACDA. So in this case, we're gonna do uh, eight cc's. So we're gonna do 60 mLs of blood today. Okie dokie. What I'd like to do is after we uh, take the whole blood, we want to invert the, the syringe several times to make sure that we get the ACDA mixed up with the blood properly. After this, we go ahead and inject this into the angel apparatus. Begin by opening the centrifuge lid and lift the centrifuge stator arm. Insert the separation chamber into the centrifuge adapter, taking care to align the notches on the centrifuge adapter. Turn clockwise until the safety wings lock. Lower the centrifuge stator arm. Place the tubing in the centrifuge well slot. Close the centrifuge lid. Place the tubing over the pump rotor. Seat the valve assembly by aligning it with a valve driver. Press down firmly until the assembly snaps into place. Turn the pump rotor clockwise to seat the tubing. Hang the three compartment reservoir bag on the two support pins located on the side of the angel machine. Attach the PRP collection syringe to the PRP valve port. The Arthrix Angel system is now ready to use. Press Disposable Set is loaded to advance to the next screen. Centrifugation of whole blood requires ACDA at a ratio of 7 to 1. To begin processing, introduce the blood sample into the whole blood in compartment and then recap the port. To process a different volume of blood, adjust accordingly with the volume arrows. Press the green start button to begin the centrifugation process. As blood is drawn from the whole blood reservoir and loaded into the separation chamber, it will pass through the platelet sensor. The angel incorporates three sensors to separate blood components using cell-specific wavelengths of light. The angel can process 40 to 180 milliliters of whole blood in a single cycle. The angel will automatically adjust spin times and speeds when volume and hematocrit values are changed. The adaptive spin technology utilized by the angel system ensures optimal platelet recovery. The first component to be harvested is the platelet pore plasma. As the platelet pore plasma passes through the sensor, the PPP is directed into its collection compartment. Next is the platelet-rich plasma. When the presence of platelets is detected by the 470 nanometer light beam, the valve is adjusted to direct the PRP into the collection syringe. PRP collection will continue until the 930 nanometer light beam detects red blood cells. Again, the angel automatically adjusts the valve position to direct the red blood cells into the RBC out compartment. The Angel system is the only device that allows the user to custom tailor PRP formulation. Platelet concentration, white blood cell content, and volume are all adjustable. Revolutionary flexibility with one button automation. If a concentrated PRP is desired, the PRP syringe may be disconnected. To increase the volume of the PRP syringe by diluting with PPP, simply pull back on the syringe plunger. If only platelet pore plasma is desired, it may be withdrawn from the port on the PPP compartment. To complete processing, press End Case.